i here how are imaginary number shown 2 plus i3 that is an imaginary number these imaginary numbers cannot be shown on the number line and real numbers can be shown on the number line so this statement is true next a real number p is said to be the root of a quadratic equation ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0 if ap square plus bp plus c equals to 0 so it means that if you input the value of p in this instead of x you must get 0 so that is true every root must satisfy the equation so if alpha or p is the root of the equation this then a alpha square plus b alpha plus c should be equal to 0 or if p is the root in our case then a p square plus b p plus c should be equal to 0 so that's why it is true next if the roots of an equation x square plus 2 c x plus a b equals to 0 are real and unequal then the equation x square minus 2 into a plus b into x plus a square plus b square plus 2 c square equals to 0 has dash roots means real or imaginary so what is given roots are real and unequal therefore b square minus 4 ac will be greater than 0 right if they are equal then equals to 0 therefore let's see this now what is b over here 2c 2c square minus 4 into a is 1 and c is ab so 2c the whole square minus 4ab equals to uh, greater than 0 therefore 4c square minus 4ab greater than 0 therefore c square minus ab greater than 0 ok this much is clear now check this similarly b square minus 4ac for the second equation here we don't know whether it's greater than or equal to or less than 0 we have to check ok so b can to watch the videos further, kindly download Yogaguru app from Play Store and follow the paid version in 10 plus 2 section. You can also WhatsApp on the number 9960560404 to get the videos permanently on your PC and on your mobile. What you get in these videos? IMO, IEO, IGKO, ISEO, NSO, NCO, Homi Baba plus many other exams questions with explanations. So keep studying, keep watching.